Hi guys and welcome to a new video from the Freestyle Junkies. Today we are going to unbox and install the new Holy Smoke Pump version 2 in my Extreme Hot Extra MG. But yeah, let's start with the unboxing after the intro. So when you buy the Holy Smoke Pump, there isn't only the smoke pump in your package, there are also some accessories in there, like a few stickers with the Holy Smoke logo on it. Then there's also a little instruction manual. Yeah, there is written how to install the pump and the spe specifications on with, for the pump. And then you also have a little fuel line. It's very nice because it's heat resistant and you can use it for your exhaust, for the connection for your exhaust. And there are also some filters. As there's a filter for your smoke tank. You install it in the tank and yeah, that's cleaning your tank so when you have dirt in your tank yeah that's not good for your pump and I say a uh, clean pump is a heavy pump so use this filter then you don't have any problems with that what we also got in there is a splitter so it splits your fuel line from the output of the pump and then you can go with the two outputs from the splitter to your exhaust it's very simple you also have two of the stop ventils included these are very important when you fly in competitions and you want to have on off smoke. Yeah, that's when you turn turn your pump on, the pump immediately starts and when you turn it off, the pump immediately, immediately stops and the smoke will disappear in a few seconds. So these things are very important. You have two of them and you install these two after the splitter. So you have your filter then you have your pump there the pump is pumping your smoke oil then you have your splitter and from your splitter you go to your two exhausts like that and there are these two injectors and you inject your smoke oil and you have a very nice finish yeah so and then we have our smoke pump the smoke pump is a very light pump it only writes 64 gram and it's not that tall so I have very big hands and you see the small pump is very small it's a very nice small pump it's very simple you have there your motor your ESC and there's the pump it's very simple then you have two cables one is for your battery and one for your receiver but you can also plug the battery cable into your receiver because yeah your receiver powers also powers the pump it's no problem you can plug it in and it's a plug and play system plug it in and it really works very well but yeah oh I just forgot one thing we also have some smoke okies but they are not included you have to yeah buy them when you want them that um, that costs 46 dollars not that much for these okies they are handmade and they work pretty fine but I won't um, install them because my MTV resources are included with some Okies and I don't want to cut the Okies the original Okies out and put them into this but if you have some stockies or new exhaust without any smoke Okies put them inside and then you're ready to go uh, yeah that's all what's included the package you don't need more than this stuff and I think we can now switch to the building in part. So after the unboxing part I want now to switch to the installation part and I want to talk about how to install the pump and then I want to show you how I did it and yeah let's start with that. So yeah the installation of the pump is really simple. We only have to drill two holes in our wood where we want to place the pump like there and there and then we only have to screw it in and the pump is ready to go um, the only thing we have to do is to connect the pump with the receiver um, but you can also connect one cable of the pump with the receiver and one with the battery that also works but you can also plug the bo both cables into the receiver that works as well so then the other thing what i did is ah, the installation of the filter in our tank how I told you um, in the unboxing part then 
I installed a little safety wire like I did it there. Then I installed a smoke line from the output of the tank into the input of the smoke pump. Then from the output of the smoke pump I um, go out and then <laughs> I um, connected it with our splitter and from the splitter I go to the stop ventil. You only have to be careful about because there's a little direction arrow and it must be in the right um, direction. So that's the only thing you have to be careful about. So the last step is to connect our stop ventil with our exhaust like I did it there. And then I also installed some of our safety wires. You see there, there and yeah, also there. You see, it's very simple. Um, yeah, I did it in about, let's say, 30 minutes, it's not that hard, everyone can do it. And then you have a very, very nice result. And it, it's perfect, yeah. At the end of the video, I really hope you liked the first part of the video. In the second part, I'm going to show, show you how to program the pump with Yeti. And I also want to um, thank Holy Smoke Pump at the end of the video for the cooperation. Um, I hope you liked the first part of the yeah of the video i did so yeah i think i'm done with the video hope you like it um i would be happy from a like and a free sub and let me know how you um yeah how you like the videos in our comments and yeah see you next friday bye